so we did glycine there. And then um, this structure would be, well, I, we, we don't have to name it, but um, what does it look like structure-wise? What would you call this molecular geometry? Trigonal pyramidal or trigonal planar? I call it trigonal pyramidal because it looked like the red drooped down a little bit. But it's really hard to see because we don't really see it from all angles. So they're not all the same. Yeah, they're calling it trigonal planar. I call it trigonal pyramidal. Um, yeah, because it looked like it was dropping down here more than there. So, but whatever. I, I would make it a bit more clear. How about this one? This should be easy. This is linear. How about this one? This is trigonal pyramidal. Um, they called it trigonal pyramidally. They also said there's an isotope for oxygen 12. Oxygen 12 isotope. Okay, that's a new one. Um, you know, there, there, there's more, uh, you know, um, there's oxygen 16, oxygen 17, oxygen 18. There are actually more isotopes of oxygen, but they're radioactive. They make carbon Yeah, they make carbon as well. Well, um, let's go on. What's this one? Bent. Bent at 109 or bent at 120? I, I can't really tell, but this is 109 because red is oxygen and white is hydrogen, so it's got to be water. This one should be easy, though. Tetrahedral. This one? Bent. Okay. All right, that's all. Unfortunately, we have time for today. But we're going to continue. We're going to continue um, talking about angles.